eye-catching displays, a news sharing session, and a documentary screening. The footprint of China's latest lunar journey is making big impressions at the ongoing International Astronautical Congress. Another exciting day at the Miko Convention Center in Milan, and you can see the excitement. Now, China National Space Administration will present a report on the latest discoveries of the Chang'e 6 mission. That the sample retrieved by Chang'e 6 are lighter in color, and the whiter material can also be seen very clearly in the large rock, having a low density, looser structure. China also announced future lunar missions. Chang'e 7 and Chang'e 8, which will feature more global collaboration and study the South Pole of the Moon. While the research sharing session is in full swing, the exhibition hall is capturing the public imagination. It's surrounded by over 100 key exhibitors from space agencies and private companies from all across the world. The highlight here, China's latest lunar journey achievement. One of the exhibits highlights China's lunar exploration missions over the past two decades. Visitors have been keen to know every detail of their journey. How is it fixed in space? The lunar samples that Chang'e 6 brought from the far side of the moon are drawing crowds. When they explain to us that coming from the dark side of the moon, they were very fascinated from it. I would like to go to the moon one day. Thank you. So back here, the session has been wrapped up with plenty of enthusiasm of what lies ahead. As we know that four international payloads have been carried on board China's Chang'e 6 mission, and many more are eager to join China's upcoming lunar missions. Yeah, it's quite interesting to see uh, payloads being carried by China for other countries. I know that we logged them on our database, but I, I, I'm, I didn't know. I was quite impressed by how many other countries you had. It's a story of human unity, beautifully told in a CGTN documentary screened in the display area. From the moon to the Mars, people around the world are expecting more from the further reaches of the universe, opportunities that should be equally enjoyed by all countries. Huang Chang, CGTN at the exhibition hall. Wulei, CGTN at the conference hall of the IEC, Milan in Italy.